So, I'm here at the water cube again with Baba, Baba Khan. Could you please uh, show me your badge? Just your finger over there, this. Yeah. Oh, that looks great. Okay. So, Baba, yeah. go ahead. Wh who uh, are I you and what do you do? I'm Baba Khan and I'm a student, master's program student at SLU, IWRM. Over here, I'm working as junior repertoire. Okay. But originally, I'm from Pakistan. So many things happening in the, this big event. All yeah. Around, like, there are 2,500 people from the development and governmental sector over here. Yeah. Talking all about water and their provision. Mm -hmm. Like everyone should have adequate and equitable, reliable water for everyone. And mostly, like the topic our group was mainly focusing on, ensuring human and environmental health. Okay. Yeah. But like, uh, there were other problems going on with it, like. Uh, many people were talking more about IWRM practices in their projects and now actually they're adopting. That's good for me because I'm in the same program and I'm learning it because I know the uh, significance of IWRM mm -hmm. in the projects and how it is sustainable for everything. And uh, regarding to the environmental um, thing, it's like uh, because everything is so integrated with everything. Yeah. And uh, and this is, I, I recall the Swedish mayor's speech, and he was saying that uh, Stockholm was not that clear uh, in, uh, in the environmental perspective, and the water was not that, that clear in the beginning. But it was later on, then when the uh, textile industries they they were pushed back, and then later on they moved to the underdevelopment countries because mm. uh, uh, the textile is like. Uh, it's such a mess, like it creates so much pollution and now he was saying that now we are buying all the textile from mm -hmm. India and Bangladesh. Yeah, yeah. yeah, But like those countries also need to take care of their water resources because they have most of the problem with their water resources and um, human health issues. Mm -hmm. So uh, you, uh, a junior rapporteur, uh, wh what does that mean? Junior rapporteur, like we, we, we work together uh, in, the uh, in the five teams. Yeah, uh, with the different topics, issues, and we are taking like all the seminars that are relevant to our issues. Yeah, and then at the end of the day, we have a meeting every day, and we discuss everything all the day, and we have to report okay. after the whole week. Okay. Later. So, so you've got an insight of all the sessions. Yeah. What was your highlight this week? Your this personal highlight. My personal highlight is like. Uh, uh, they are like, uh, what do you what do you mean by like? Is there a, a certain presentation that was really uh, good or really interesting for you? As yeah. uh, I like the presentation by um, two persons actually. Um, uh, one is Sanita, uh, she's Indian, and um, she had a presentation of uh, she, because it was so realistic and yeah. and it, it didn't come up with like many like what we want now or mm. it was mainly focusing on the Indian issues and the cultural and technical perspectives of sanitation okay. and how, how, how because it's uh, uh, it's it's also a matter of dignity and everything with them yeah it, it's everything and the other guy was I forgot his name he was a researcher and a professor on the basically from Pakistan and he was mainly focusing on on the floods in Pakistan, mm -hmm. uh, and uh, yeah, it, it was really very good because there was a session going on that uh, uh, about the dams, wetlands and dams, yeah. and he was uh, at the end of the question on session. He was saying that come on, like so many years have been passed out, and still uh, you are talking about dams. Yes or no? After such a catastrophic yeah. event, and like you have to see the tsunami and now Pakistan, and mm -hmm. still you think that there should be dams, but he's saying that like there is no way forward going on. We come here every time and discuss many things, but now we should, should come for uh, reliable solutions for that. So after that, like, they have been a little bit serious and they have been discussing yeah. reproductive yeah, things. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. that was really really nice and interesting. Okay, well, great. Yeah. Good to hear that you enjoyed your week, and uh, well, we just have two more days left. Yeah. So, uh, well, thank you for this interview. Yeah, sure. And good luck. Have fun.